Political science professor Bob McClure says the 24th congressional race is a good example of a lesson he teaches to his students. That the most difficult thing to learn to do in democracy is to lose. However, one candidate had no issue admitting defeat. Ursula Rosam of the Green Party delivered her concession speech last night. And in terms of the direction the race is going. Whether it's him or Anne-Marie that win, they're going to be hearing from me, and they're going to be hearing from the Peace Council, and they're going to be hearing from the Green Party. And so um, I think that Dan might be a little bit easier to work with on some of the issues that we care about. Now, just to give you some perspective on the discrepancy of resources between the Green Party and the other two candidates. This is the Green Party headquarters. So at the end of the day, Ursula is pleased, walking away with 9% of the vote. In terms of her overall impact on the race, Professor McClure thinks it was minimal. It wasn't a role that was a spoiler. Um, uh, had she been absent from the race, I presume that Dan Maffei's margins um, would be slightly higher. So is this the end of Rosam's political career? You'll be hearing from me, and I might not be the candidate, but, you know, the Green Party, we're, we're not going away, and we hope that um, next time we'll see more Green voters, and I hope that my supporters are here to stay as well. They may not be the victors, but third-party candidates are here to stay. Reporting in Syracuse, I'm Dora Scheidel.